Hey guys, and welcome to my new movie review. For those of you who have just joined my channel, first of all, this is an absolutely warm welcome. It is so unbelievably good to have you here. Thank you for clicking on this link. My name is Superman Steve, and I'm about to give you the movie review that came out this year, 2021, Buddy Games. Buddy Games is rated MA15+. The duration of Buddy Games is one hour and 30 minutes long. Buddy Games is a comedy. Now this one's a little bit weird guys. I know it actually says on IMDb that it came out in 2019, but it has just been released in cinema now. So wh whether this has been a delayed production or not, I'm not too sure, but I saw it tonight. So there you go. It's directed by Josh Duhamel. I apologize if I'm butchering that name. And the cast of Buddy Games is as follows. First off we have Dan Bacadol, who plays the character of Shelley. Kevin Dillon, who plays the character of Doc. Olivia Munn, who plays the character of Tiffany. James Rodé Rodriguez, who plays the character of Zane. Drac Shepard, who plays the character of Durfee. Nick Swartzen, who plays the character of Bender. Linda Darlow, who plays the character of Mary Ann. And obviously, guys, a slew of other cast members. And right after I roll this synopsis, guys, I will give you my personal thoughts on Buddy Games. A group of friends reunite to play Buddy Games, a wild assortment of obscured physical and mental challenges in the process. They'll heal old wounds, right past wrongs, and figure out the true meaning of friendship or die trying. Straight off the back, guys, I actually want to talk to you about editing. Now, for those of you who have been following my channel at all, I do not do spoilers in my movie reviews at all, so fear not, you will not get spoilers from me at all in this movie review. However, I want to just say something about this movie, a little, little nitpick about this movie, and then I'll tell you all the good stuff that I really, really liked about this movie. So straight off the bat, there's a scene really, really, really close to the start of the film, and um, go Budfather gets a knock at the door, and then all of a sudden, it's like it's almost like they missed a scene. Like that's that's what it felt like. And then, literally straight after that, they like they're having he's having a conversation with one of his buddies in the pool, and I thought to myself. Why didn't they just put like a two second scene in of him opening the door and letting whoever was in? And that part of the movie confused me. And I was like, wait, who was at the door? Like it just made no sense because they just automatically skip straight to the pool. Anyway, other than that, I totally know that I'm nitpicking guys. Anyone who's been following my channel for any period of time, you guys know that I love character chemistry because when a storyline is fantastic, Character chemistry is absolutely vital for it to work, or else us as an audience member, we just don't buy it. It is that simple. We're just like, yeah, no, that's, you know, if a couple loves each other and they they, they have an incredible on, set, on chemistry on camera, and then it's like, oh, wow, that's so dynamic. But if it doesn't work, then it really, really, really doesn't work for us. Guys, I kid you not. You absolutely must go and check out this movie. Seriously, this is an absolutely brilliant movie with incredible character chemistry. The laughs just keep on coming. Literally, they are brilliant. The scripting is so funny. It is dynamic, it is brilliant, it is clever. This is seriously one of the absolute most brilliant films that you will, you will see in a really, really, really long time. This has really brilliant laugh out loud moments throughout the entire film. Honestly, just some of the jokes are so unbelievably clever. The, the, the way that they, they just interact with each other as friends, you buy every single element of it. Honestly, guys, this is a brilliant, brilliant film. Honestly, the, 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 if you've seen the trailer, which is, you know, kind of the start of this movie review, part of it is anyway, 
then you'll see in it that that there's a, an element of this movie, guys, where they're they they you know buddy games are happening and they they've got to you know dare and do challenges and all that sort of stuff. And one of the things that I thought was really really clever about the challenges was some of the things that they were actually challenged to do was so unbelievably well thought out. Like I mean, it really really was. And for the first time director of this, he really, really, really did a well job, well done job. As I said, the only nitpick I had was was actually the editing element. And like, as a director, he's he was he's responsible for that. But in saying that, absolutely on point, guys. This is just a staggeringly brilliant, funny, funny, funny movie. It really, really, really makes you appreciate if you have a group of friends like this, the dynamic and the relationship that you have together and just the jokes just keep on coming, honestly. This has fart jokes in it, guys. This has dirty humor in it, guys. This has, it, it, it's just silly humor that you walk away with at the end of the day going, yep, yeah, that was funny. It has all of that stuff, guys, but but it works. It really, really, really works. The char- As I said, the character chemistry works. Everything, the dynamic in it. Now, I have to say this. I'm going to say this, and I know this might be a little bit of a weird thing to say, but I am going to say it. One of the things that I was a little tiny bit surprised about in this movie, guys, and I don't know whether it was because of the pacing of the film or whether some scenes just happened to be a little slower than most. I'm not too sure, guys. But even though this movie only runs for an hour and a half, surprisingly, surprisingly, I actually felt the runtime. I know that sounds a little bit weird, especially for a comedy, but there were stages of this movie that I actually thought to myself, wow, this movie is still going, and I thought, and it only went for an hour and a half, which is a really weird thing to think about if you think about movie run times and a comedy and you know there's not not every single second of the movie do you like are you crying laughing and stuff like that but in saying that this it, it just it happened to just be one of those things guys that I just thought to myself huh I actually feel the runtime of this movie like I thought to myself probably maybe about three times throughout the whole movie wow this I feel like this is dragging on a little bit, but I mean, it was. Don't get me wrong. It what that's not a bad thing. I just I felt it. I felt the runtime, which is very very unusual. But those of you who have been following my channel for any period of time, you guys know that I love to talk about one of the one of the core essential things, guys. That film needs to be filmed realistically for us as an audience member to go back days, months, years later and go back. And rewatch it, which I like to call, in my personal opinion, and those of you who have been following my channel for any period of time, is exactly what I'm about to say right now. Say it with me in three, two, one. Rewatchability, guys. Does does Buddy Game have rewatchability, guys? Does it? You know it does. In absolute spades. Seriously, guys. This is an absolute knockout of the park comedy. It is brilliant. It is funny. It is clever. It's got class, guys. You will not regret watching this movie. Honestly, you will not regret watching this movie. This is a brilliant movie. I'm so unbelievably grateful and glad that I went and saw this movie. Seriously, I, I cannot recommend it enough at all. I really, really can't. You guys are amazing, and for those who have been watching my channel for any period of time and following my channel, you guys know at the end of my movie reviews, I like to give you guys trivia, because in my personal opinion, trivia in a movie review, oh, it's like icing on a cake, yum, and who doesn't love cake, guys, I love cake. Guys, so it's trivia time. This movie is the director's debut tutorial of Josh Duhlmall. Yeah, this is his first movie ever. So there you go, guys. Guys, I appreciate your time. You guys have been absolutely amazing. Thank you so much for sticking in here. You guys are incredible. Thank you again so much. Guys, if you're new to my channel and you haven't already, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to click that bell for notifications. And don't forget to leave a thumbs up on this movie review. That way I know you're appreciating my content. And if you're new, this is an absolutely warm welcome. So, so good to have you. I appreciate your time. Don't forget who's bringing this movie review. 
for buddy games. This is Superman Steve, appreciating you guys always and loving your time. Thank you so much. Flying out!